Selecting wall surfaces and trusses in Premiere is pretty straightforward. Your cursor of your mouse will be in selection mode by default. And you've got three options there. You can select the object, you can do a sub object, and you can select a point. I'm just going to stick with object for now to explain this. And you can see you've got three different means of selecting objects. First of all, you've got box, then you've got line. And then lastly, you've got lasso. Box select. How would that work? Basically, you're going to drag a box. Or you can still click on objects to select them. But with box select, you click and drag a box. And if you go from top left to bottom right, anything inside, fully inside the box will get selected. If you then click and drag from bottom right to top left, anything that touches the box will get selected. Then you've got line. Basically line is a selection tool that will select any object that you drag a line through. You can see there if I drag through the trusses it selects the trusses and it also selects the surface plane there. And that's also a very functional one that you can use. Another option that you have is lasso. Lasso you can either go clockwise to select objects or you can go anti-clockwise to select objects. How it works is if you go clockwise and you select your objects and you draw a uh, area around your objects, everything that's inside that lasso will get selected. And if you go anti-clockwise, anything that gets touched by that lasso will get selected. Another way to select objects in Palmyra would be on the left hand side. You can see if I want my surfaces, I can just select that, which will select all surfaces. I can select framing here by clicking on it, which will select all the trusses. Or if I only want to select the walls, I can click on that and I can select the walls like that. And you do that uh, from the left hand menu. 